So you might be in this interesting situation where for some reason Apple intelligence is not working. Now, this can mean a couple of different things. Number one, if you are up to date on iOS and iOS 18 in general, and you're noticing that you know Apple intelligence and Siri is basically missing in settings, this could be because you don't have an iPhone 15 Pro or any other iPhone like that. So you can see right here, I have an iPhone 15, and in the future, even though iOS 18.1 beta, you know, one is not available for you know these particular iPhones. In the future, if you are on an iPhone version and it's supposed to be supported with iOS, you know, and Apple intelligence, you want to make sure your iPhone supports Apple intelligence. If you have an iPad, iPhone, Mac, whatever you have, and it's not supported, well, that's going to be the number one thing that can give you issues. So double check that. That's kind of the first thing I recommend doing and making sure that you have an iPhone that is supported on iOS, uh, you know, that is supported on Apple intelligence. It's the iPhone 15 Pros or above and any of the Macs or iPads that have the M1 chipsets. Now, if you do that and that doesn't seem to be working, you might also want to make sure you're up to date on iOS 18. So click on general, click on software update, and you can see right here, I'm on iOS 17. iOS 17 does not have Apple intelligence. You're going to have to be on an iOS version that supports it, which is iOS 18 or above, or in this case, iOS 18.1 beta or above. So you may want to just look, if you're watching this like three months from now, you may want to see what the requirements are for iOS and update to that particular version of iOS for Apple intelligence. So that's the other thing. Another thing you can try doing is to restart your iPhone. If all those things are right, you can try restarting your particular iPhone. So slide the power off, wait a few seconds, power back on, and you want to see if that ends up fixing it, which for some people it might. I think the big thing though is the hardware or software issues. You know, if you don't have an iPhone 15 Pro, you're not going to be able to do this. If you're not on iOS 18, the version with Apple intelligence, you're not going to be able to do it either. So do those two things and then you pretty much will be good to go. So that's basically how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.